this international world, no, international world of the dog day today. Woo! <laughs> Go on, baby, do your stuff. Take the floor. Give us a bit of John Travolta. Not John from the Go on. Go on. Woo! Do you need some more next to <laughs> Morning, guys. How are you doing? Oh, here we go. This is the gusset left from Mark tearing my bikini pants apart with his teeth. I didn't think I was going to get that close to a gusset this morning. <laughs> I genuinely didn't. <laughs> oh, my God. Anyway, hello, everybody. Morning. Yes, Boris has had a baby. Yes. Can you believe it? Can you believe it? That we have to thank Nanny Di for reminding us that today is International, International Dance Did Day. Did she actually call you to say that? Yeah, my mum someone... loved dancing. She was a big dancer. Yeah, she did. That's how she did her knees in. Yeah. Oh, bloody hell, guys. So that's why my gear isn't great. It's because it was made by Mark's teeth. Yeah, make do and men. So oh, look, Nanny Di. Oh, wow, I wish I was there. That was brilliant, Nanny Di. <laughs> we wish you were here too. Doing this, Mum. Doing I think this. all day today, all day today, we should have little blasts of dance. So when you're feeling low, when you're feeling anxious today, just put on the music and just dance for one minute all day. Just put them on. Selena Lou Frog, morning, I'm ready for 80s disco, disco moves. Brilliant. That's at 11.30 on my friend's new Instagram account, Dance Your Tits Off. <sighs> I've so, got to go to the shops. Will you be yeah. filming yourself a little bit? Well, no, because I'm going to be dancing. Yeah, you can film I'm yourself. Doing, no, I've funny. got it on live on Speed Instagram. It up. Oh, it's live on your Instagram? Well, no, it's live on her Instagram. But I, I want to get help, get new people to go over there by doing it live on my Instagram. Yeah, too. yeah, and then use the third, uh, the other camera. You can film yourself. It'd be funny. Okay. Um, Joyce Bryce and your antibiotics. Oh, oh dear. No. I've got terrible biliousness today. I do apologise if I seem to go... Bloop, bloop. Uh, that was fun. That was fun. That helped. What with my bicarbonate of soda. So what do we reckon? Baby Boris Could boy. Could there be any more insane times than the times we're having? Boris nearly died. Yeah. No. First of all, we have a uh, pandemic. Right. That, the, of we, the likes that we, we haven't seen in a hundred years. Right. Then we have a man in office who wanted to be king of the world. That's right. what he said when he was growing up. Right. Then he nearly bloody dies of the thing. He does. And then... First baby born. Oh no, Blair had a baby born, didn't he? <coughs> down the street. No, Gordon it's... Brown. And Blair did the last baby. Did he? Yeah, sure the last Gordon one was born. No, and the last one. Oh, so they all have them. Okay, so forget that bit. But it is quite extraordinary. We also have a confirmation from the American authorities that UFOs have been seen by the by the by the American Air Force. They've confirmed the footage that was running around. And, and confirmed that it was a fleet of flying objects. You are. Yeah, did anyone? Kidding. Yeah, Shelley Moss, the US have released alien footage. Have you not put it on the title here? Well, no, because I thought you'd think I was crackpot. Put this it is, on. This, this is footage. People will want to talk so about guys, that. So, guys, guys, has this changed from yesterday? I, I've seen the footage before, but is it anything different to the footage that we've seen before? It doesn't mean that it's any less real, but the fact that the American government have confirmed it for what it is. Suggest that it could Leggy well be. Leggy Blonde, that's really made me laugh. She said, I've just watched one of your vlogs just to confirm there is no knife in a large pot of Nutella. <laughs> <laughs> that was Maddie's thing, wasn't it? Oh, how funny. Um, loving your 80s gear, Nadia. Thank you, Lucy. Are you going to join me today at half 11 for an 80s workout? It's only 15 to 20 minutes because I said to my friend, it's got to be short because my lot don't like to do a lot of exercise. Yeah. She's doing it especially for us a lot. I love doing exercise. Huh? I love doing it. I don't like doing 80s exercise. No, no, no. A lot of our, a lot of our subscribers ah. struggle because they don't feel like getting up because they feel ah, down. Sorry. But when you get up, do you already feel better just from that little bit of dancing? I do, except my billiousness is worse. He's a good dancer, is isn't he? No, yeah. I think jumping about would be good for it, Johnny. Yeah, yeah. yeah. okay. Um, I, I do like to cut and move. I loved our first dance. To I now remember Mojo was the band, Lady was the song. Can't you put something on like that now? We can have a little dance of it. Uh, 
Can you put it? Because if we put the actual tune well, on, hang on YouTube, it will we turn do, us off. Before we do the dance, let's talk about, yeah, Boris's baby boy. I don't know why. It felt like it came early. Did it come early? Oh, I feel like it's early. It feels like it was only five minutes ago. We found out she was pregnant. Yeah. But, but life and Suzanne time... Suzanne Stone asking, was it born early? Because, but time is very weird at the minute, isn't it? It is... It, we, I mean, God, what a difficult time to be pregnant as well. And then yeah. you are partners in and at death's door yeah. so andrea liberadsky please stop it you two i can't take anymore my ribs are still hurting from last night's singing <laughs> yesterday was quite hysterical on the channel wasn't it there was singing there was the vlog which was just beyond stupid who watched the vlog last night the reality show that's what we're saying because new people don't know what a vlog show, means if we keep calling it the reality show guys don't think we're weird it's just we've discovered that that a lot of our age group do not know what a vlog means yeah so we've been saying, watch our vlog, watch our vlog. And then lots of people have been saying to you, what is that thing you always talk about, a vlog? It's like, oh my God, it's a reality show. Yeah. So. Drew Haylett, you've been, sorry, you've, I've missed this a few times. Can we have a festival vlog where you review the best acts from past years? Oh, yeah, we, don't, we, don't, we don't really... We don't really go to festivals, no. sadly. Uh, I don't think we've been any good at it. But thank you for asking Who's Benny good at it? Any good at it, I, I think. I thought you said I don't know who Benny good at it is. Of course I didn't. Well, you could have done. You say weird things sometimes. Um... Hi, pa Paigey. How are you? Hi, Andrina Oh, we have a new Bain. member. Who's that? Nikki Adams. Welcome, Nikki Adams. New member to family guest. Welcome. Uh, Raz, B B Raz BCN. Loved your Spain and Greece holiday vlogs. I felt like I was on holiday too. I know. I said to Kiki, because she's really missing Greece. I said, let's just sit down and watch the Greece vlog again. But then I didn't know whether that would make us sad. Yeah, but someone just said, yeah, I know what you mean. Is Hi, someone... Suzanne Davis. Oh, I love so much watching... The reality show. Amelia Stanley, hang on. Since when was it April? I've been writing March and all my college work. <laughs> I know what you mean. It is odd. I wrote an old-fashioned check today and I thought, oh my what God. month are we? It was so funny yesterday, on last night in the vlog. I don't know if you saw it, but um, we were saying how we're nearly at 100,000 subscribers. And then we were talking about, many of you will know this, about Mark having to go into labour for eight hours as a surprise for all of you. With this lady yeah, suit, is... and somebody who must have been fairly new came up and went, Hey, what is Mark giving birth? That was a bit of an odd one. They actually thought he was gonna have a baby. Am I having a water birth, no music, sir? <laughs> no, because I think it might electrocute you because I think you're wired up to electricity. Have you ordered the labour suit? Where are you gonna have you I'm really in discussions with the people okay. at Loose Women that got it. At the moment, where they got the one before is from Amsterdam, but I have seen that they've got some oh. in Oxford. So Could we, we go to Amsterdam to... first we for might a bit be... of a fun weekend and then I'll do it? Uh, Darling, we can't go to the corner of the bloody road at the moment. Jessica minute. Woodstock, I can't deal honestly. You're so funny. Yesterday I like I cried of laughter about eight Oh, times. that makes us so happy. Uh, uh, an interesting sideline detail here, talking of Amsterdam, that's the only reason it came into my mind, was, of course, another industry that's been decimated by this is the sex worker industry. There's countless sex workers who are finding themselves oh God, destitute no with no money absolutely um so you know it's funny all the different walks of life oh look nanny die how do people manage to write so much on this i can't ever keep up i know they're incredibly fast we were doing a so premiere fast. last night mum and each of us was like nye, nye. you're very fast guys did you like the premiere guys where we were like watching it with you and and chatting or was it distracting oh oliver masterson wondering if the ufo could have brought the covid Melissa Marnum, thank you for pretending to be Mr. McGregor yesterday for your kids. Oh, that's Do you all right. Being I, Mr. McGregor? Within, like, yesterday was like a drunken blur for me. People so many actually moments. actually thought we were drunk. We weren't. We were so high So many life. moments that I keep forgetting, and people text me and they say, Did you remember saying, I've got the same regret that I used to have when I was drinking? I was going, Mr. McGregor? <laughs> <laughs> when did I do Mr. McGregor? What was I doing for Mr. McGregor? Yeah, the pregnancy suit is a fab idea, Suzanne Shaw. I'm going to get onto that today. I wonder if there pregnancy are any other suit. children's characters we could impersonate at any point. Don't know. Mr. McGregor's one of the most curious. Bungle. Do you remember Bungle? Bung, bungle. Gabrielle's bungle. ordered a trampoline. Yay. Uh, love that brolly. Where did you get it yesterday? Um, oh, it's really old. Yeah. I reckon if you put into Amazon <coughs> uh, rainbow umbrella, something would come up. Rainbows are very in at the moment, aren't they? Oh, you were listening. We mustn't forget to wear our nice rainbow sh sh shirts for Clap for Heroes. We didn't wear them last week. That's right, yeah, we did. For didn't. the NHS. Please, guys, who's going to join us for the quiz this Saturday night? We're doing one big, crazy night, and we're also going to, it's going to be a fundraiser. 
again for Childline. They really, really appreciate what we've done, all of us, the community here have done together. And we're gonna give them one last blast and then we'll move on to a refuge Tip. centre. Um, Tip. <laughs> do you have any other underwear that I can rip with my teeth? Do you want to see my... I want to rip it with my teeth. Do you teeth. want to see my uh, leg warmers? Aren't they cool? Look. Dina's friend hand-knitted them. They're great, aren't they? I could stay a... like this all day. I think it's giving me energy. It's taking me back to my youth. It was giving me taking something. Taking me back to my youth again. Taking me back to my roots. Oh, sorry. Take me back to my roots, roots again. Yeah, yeah. That's all we need. Alien invasion, I know. It's all we bloody need. Well, if I'm brutally honest, if aliens came down now and said, what would you rather, this lockdown or a trip to our gaff, I'd be like, let's check out your gaff. You never know, it might be know. better. Why are my veins really showing like Can spaghetti? Can you imagine if we get an alien invasion? God, on top of all this. And well, they found you, you was... look like a freaking alien. <laughs> I don't think they would, I don't think... They, I don't think, I don't think it us. would surprise us, to be honest. Want us. At the minute, nothing would surprise us, would it? Um, it was Where is your onion cutter from? Why has that been held back? What onion cutter? That's a curious one. Why has that been held in reserve? Shout out, please. Why has that been? Shout, maybe? I don't know. Where is your onion cutter? Cutter. Hang cutting. on, let's do the shout out after all that. Debbie, Debbie Downs. Downs. Sorry, Hello. Darling. We have an alien virus, says Leggy Blonde. We don't need yeah, aliens exactly. too. Maybe the aliens have lost their virus and they're looking for it. Drew Haylett, did Lisa ever get you guys back from the toilet gate from you went, when you went camping? No, but she got Mark back yesterday. We did a FaceTime and she got him back for something. Not That's really. going to be in the vlog a Not little really. bit. I thought she just had a bad day. I thought it was her. <laughs> uh, Maybe ET is coming Kate home, and Jamie Wills Hedges. Married nine years to Dale. It's their anniversary. Do you remember how romantic that wedding was? Oh Who's... my God, I loved that wedding. Kate and Wills, do you remember? Ten we watched... years ago. We, we watched... No, nine. We watched it with Nanny Thelma. Oh, we went down and you we made her a to... breakfast. Yeah, and, and we took all, because she's she was very patriotic, so we bought we bought her, we didn't we bought her that... Um, the tray, tray with the with the Union Jack on, and then we got and we did sandwiches, her favourite sandwiches, and we did little sausage rolls, and we had an all day garden party in her sitting room. Do you remember? Mm. And I felt depressed after that wedding. We all did, didn't we? Because yeah. it was so romantic. Yeah. And we all just Thanks. thought. Maybe I think at that point we were all wanting a bit of romance in our lives, weren't we? Yeah. Why is it always down to you? Why did you go? Thanks. Well, because you were the one Maybe I didn't. I, wasn't I didn't romantic. feel disappointed. I felt uh, it's all all right at the moment. It's a bit of royal red, royal wedding. It's all really nice. I don't even remember. We even had we even had wedding cake. Did oh, we? I loved it. Have you heard? He's thinking of going back to the army. He wants to help Does out. Does he? He's so driven by what the what his country is going through, unlike some other people. And so um, on earth are you referring to there? Uh, well, I mean, I wonder what it is like for Harry now. Oh, right. Well, definitely. I wonder what it's like actually. I yeah. bet he's really, really wanting to be at home like everybody is everybody with such with with such a nightmare going on you'd want to be back in your own country wouldn't you you would i think you'd better answer done 9977 they're asking the onion cutter yeah where's oh, it from it's from you can get it on amazon and it's called it's xylis Xylis is the make. Z Y L I double S. How's betty's eye a lot of people are asking oh god so much better she took um a homeopathic remedy called Ledum, and it was much better. Thank God. Thank God. Um, I wonder if Witty, I wonder if Witty's doing any dancing today. I wonder if, I was wondering if we could take ownership. You know how, I mean, some people, oh, some, that's sad. some people take an offence. Oh no, what a shame. In pie, from the life that amazing of pie, film. I remember that, yeah. No, oh, that's so sad. Just died. Oh yeah, dear. Yeah, died from COVID. Oh. Mm. You know how sometimes the best way to lampoon something that's awful is to caricature it, take the mickey out of it. I think you did it very successfully with a meme on your Instagram this week where you sort of, you poke fun at it by laughing at it. It doesn't mean you're being disrespectful to what it does wrong, but it's a way of kind of taking the heat, heat out of it. I think we should have a Corona dance, like the mm. Macarena. And I think the Corona dance has spiky bits. Oh God, people will get it offended. Has you know what coffee like? bit. And then it has, what's another symptom? Fever. 
Fever. Yeah, and then you have fever. Fever. <laughs> yeah, there you go. I told you that before lockdown, Nanny Di was here and, you know, the news was starting to break and everything. She was in her room dancing to fever. Was she? Yeah. Nanny dies. Uh, What's homeopathy? Could you maybe do a video on it at some stage? Homeopathy is an ancient form of medicine. Actually, the royal family use homeopathy. And um, sorry. So it's a holistic medicine. The Corona Mash, me too. Corona Mash. So, I love your name, me too. Um, what was I going to say? Uh, someone I think just we said. Think about that doing the Corona dance. Yeah, no, I, I've got to. I've got to move. Oh, around. the Corona. Uh, Nanny die very dark. You could do a dying bit. No, no. no. Um, <laughs> Can you imagine in the world today we'll be absolutely vilified? I'm a celebrity. Get me out of here, Anna Nichols. I'm a celebrity. <laughs> I me love out. that. Anna Nichols. That's, that's a cracker. Very that's good. a cracker. It's that's a cracker. It's a very tell them. smart. Can I, uh, someone just ask if I do TikTok? What's the name of Kiki's TikTok account? I don't know, but she's got hundreds of thousands. Basically, of I did something stupid on it. She's posted it and she goes, Dad, you know, it's nearly like at half a million now. You know, it's at half a million. Is it? Yeah. TikTok. That they've told us not to do. Um, but... Oh, yes. And I do, why do my cookies are made out spongy, too much butter? Are these the ones with the jam in the middle? They're supposed to be a bit spongy. It's just I overcooked them. I, it's 50 grams, I think, if I remember rightly. 50 grams. Did you use 50 grams? Or what biscuits are you talking about? Because I made quite a few biscuits recently. Nanny died. What is Tim Tok? <laughs> oh, mum. TikTok. <laughs> Maybe that's just a slip of your, your key. TikTok. It's another social media platform that the girls have instructed us not to go on. Though uh, we all think that we could make, we could entertain people very much on there. Louise Jones. I've lost my appetite completely. Can't eat hardly anything. Gone completely off food. Have you got any tips on what I can do to stop eating again? <clears throat> How strange. It's probably because you're anxious. Is it because you're feeling anxious? It might be because you're anxious. Are you feeling unwell in any other way? Um, <clears throat> I mean, I think the thing is when people get loss of appetite, it can be, of, it can be you know, very much emotionally related. And also being given a great massive plate of food can make you put, what I would say is put very tiny amounts of food on a bigger plate and then your brain will just, not, not very tiny amount, put a, put, a, put a small amount of food on a bigger plate and then your psychologically your brain will say, oh, that's only a little bit, I can eat that. And have little nibbles, have a couple of nuts, have a little bit of fruit. Because mm. there's things like nuts and blueberries are powerhouses. They're really, really good for you. Um, or maybe do something like an oat milk or <coughs> almond milk and banana milkshake so that you're just drinking something, but you're getting and a few nuts, put in some maybe almond powder so you're still getting nutrition because you don't want to you don't want to lose your energy from not eating. What are you so cooking just today? The, the things that you eat, make sure that they're really nutrient dense. What are you cooking today? Do you know? Um, <clears throat> I haven't decided yet. Oh, okay. I've got to have a look and see what's in the Marky, fridge. and this is truly old TV, but Maddie is fuming Mark did TikTok. I didn't do it. Kiki put me on it without me knowing. Yeah. So. I wanted Mark to go on TikTok because I thought he'd do brilliantly on it and the girls were straight away. Please don't, God, please don't. But the don't. main reason was because there's Promises. so much abuse, isn't there? There's so much sort of trolling on it. They didn't want me to be trolled, aren't they, sweet? Mm. Oh. Yeah, maybe I'll look for some... Maybe I'll look and see if I've got the stuff to make soft cookies. Mm. What, like chocolate chip chewy coffee, cookies, something like that? Yeah, okay. Cherry and chocolate. Yeah. Could you get some chocolate when you go to the shop? What sort of chocolate? Oh, any kind of chocolate. Yeah, what, to put into chocolate. Mark, what did you use to film? What did you use to film? I use a camera to film. No, what kind of camera? Oh, right. You mean Canon C, Canon C3, <laughs> Canon C300. That's, that's what, what we use that's for That's what we use for broadcast television, and we use a 5D, Canon 5D for um, for the food cooking and all that kind of stuff. But for our Sunday reality show. show and for this, we just use Mark's very nice mm. phone, which gives such a lovely picture. What's the phone called? It's the iPhone 11 Pro Max. iPhone 11 Pro Max. Yeah. And oh my God, the you get the loveliest photos from it. Yeah. We should have got one for free because we were. So we don't know. She's gonna. She's gonna. She's gonna improvise with what she's cooking later. She doesn't know. I'll tell you what, that carbonara was bloody good though that you did the other day. Ooh. Oh, Louise, I've got severe anxiety. Doctor, put me on some calming tablets. 
as my depression and anxiety has gone crazy, I feel like I've got to keep my kids safe at all times. It's driving me mad. So that's maybe why you've lost your appetite. Because you've got seven children, if I remember rightly, have you, Louise? I can't imagine. And 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 it is like that, isn't it? We do have mm. to keep our kids safe all the time. And it's 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 just exhausting. The strain, the stress and strain of it is exhausting. So what I would say is just say to yourself, you know, it's okay that I feel this tired. It's understandable that I feel this anxious. It's not going to be like this forever, even though it feels like it is. And, you know, what do your kids really like to do that is very easy for you to do? Can you just lie around and watch some cartoons and have a bit of a doze with them? Don't push yourself to be decluttering, painting, sorting like a lot of people are. If you're tired, do as little as possible and rest. Because you're another reason you might you might not have appetite is because you just might be too tired. Yeah. You know, so yeah. Yeah. I've got to go to the supermarket. But you know the other thing is with any symptoms really, it's a good idea to just check with your doctor. I'm sure it's fine, but loss of appetite can mean lots of different things. It can be anxiety, but it could be lots of other things as well. So my advice would always be consult an expert. Mel W, I do still do the childlike drinking lives on Instagram. Thank you for asking. I just have a little bit of biliousness, biliousness. which I've had for the Probably last couple of days. Probably because you've been days. drinking pints really fast, actually. You've done your gut in. Possibly. But these, this has happened so much more subsequent to that. But yes, I am. And a mental marquee landed yesterday. Did you see that? He was yeah. up to no good. Yeah. He's got the old hyper hypochondricals. Hypochondrical. Done 997. I've always wanted to be a therapist. That was what I'd be if I wasn't an, a presenter yeah. or an actor. Yeah. Love it. Um, but do make sure you just have a word with your doctor about that loss of appetite. And Millie blah, blah, blah. Okay, guys, listen, we're going to go now because I've got to get ready for my aerobics dancing. I am going to Sainsbury's. So can you get some chocolate, please? Yes, I can get chocolate, some chocolate. Chocolate chip cookies. Absolutely. Cho which sort of chocolate, though? Get any chocolate. Get chocolate buttons or you can get, you can get um, Cadbury's lumps, anything. Okay. Because I can chop it up. Oh, God, I don't know whether I really want to fart or really want to burp. So, guys. Sorry. I'm going to go over to Dance Your Tits. I'm going to go on my Instagram and then I'm going to see if Dance Your Tits is live. Let me see. Go on, you go, you go to the loo. Lots of love, guys. See you later. Bye, guys. Are you ending yeah, now? Yeah, I'm just going to tell them where I'm going to Oh, okay. Be going. There you go. You finish um, it. Up. Bye. Bye. Let me see where she is. Uh... Oh yeah, car wash baby. Ooh, ooh. Car wash baby. That's a good one, isn't it? How does it go? Car wash. Okay, join me on, Inst on my Instagram now, guys. See you there in a minute. Bye.